Pisces, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. Today we are going to find out important love messages for you. This is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me important love messages for Pisces today. Empress at the bottom of the deck. Empress to me indicates marriage, pregnancy, somebody whom is very nurturing and caring. Pisces, this could be you. Again, roles can be reversed between you and the person whom you could be dealing with or thinking about currently. Okay, Pisces, five of cups here, a lot of disappointments in regards to somebody here in the past. And sometimes when I say somebody, that means it could be you or your person. And two of cups here is in reverse. And we've got the page of pentacles in reverse. This has something to do with somebody who may have been um, insincere or uh, immature, okay? Page can be immature, especially when it's in love first. And Two of Cups in reverse definitely indicates a separation. Um, and we've got the Knight of Cups here. Okay, so um, we've got Knight of Cups and the Queen of Cups in love first. Either this may indicate, okay, either you or this person, the love is still there, okay? Either this person still loves you or that you still love this person. However, Ace of Wands here is in love first. I feel like, again, you and this person are not together right now, okay? Either um, Ace of Wands in love first can indicate a rejection of a new beginning or... That was a loss of spark, okay, or interest, whether it's on your part or on your person's part. And Queen of Cups and Love First also can indicate somebody no longer is investing uh, emotionally in this connection. And Death Card definitely indicates all, um, an ending. I feel like this is this has already happened. Uh, Pisces, Three of Wands and Love First, somebody has decided to turn their back on this connection. Could also be because of a third party situation, because we've got two threes here. May not always mean that. But Three of Pentacles and Love First, it feels like maybe. Um, somebody is unwilling to work things out meet in the middle or somebody is unwilling to reconcile okay but the love is definitely still there nine of cups in an upright position and death card for me indicates also uh, a transformation for some of you maybe your love life is transforming for something to transform especially with the death card here indicates it has to have an ending first before a new beginning can begin okay let's see more pisces so new love coming in for you guys as well if you're single and looking all right pisces so we've got ace of cups empress but the ace of cups and the empress also for me can negate love self-love and self-care so for those of you if you're single perhaps practicing self-love and self-care would should be um your priority right now before you jump into a new relationship however ace of cups also can negate a new love beginning someone may see your value your worth okay and may offer you a cup of love or you may see or it could go vice versa or it's maybe it's you offering it to somebody else that you may see this person as a potential partner and the empress is not just a potential partner it's a potential lifetime partner right she's always growing she's always giving she's so abundant um, again doesn't matter he or she it's not gender specific we've got the two of wands and the devil here hmm okay i'm also sensing that could be someone from your past whom you may have given up on for pentacles and what first you may have released this person or this person may have um dropped the ball with the seven of swords here for lying cheating or being uh, deceptive in some way shape or form i feel like this person is still very much connected to you Mm, energetically okay and two of wands here this person is indecisive in regards to reaching out to you if you look at the two of wands this person is actually holding a um cell phone right so this person is contemplating whether to send you a message or not i feel like this is mm, somebody again who could have lied to you cheated on you or you know was just being a really sneaky character okay let's see more pisces
So Ace of Swords here for me indicates um, also you've got two Aces, new beginning. And it feels like this new beginning, especially also with the Death card here, um, it's like something needs to go before uh, this new beginning can begin, okay? If some of you maybe it's moving to a different place or um, if this is a long distance relationship, if not, it's about cutting off other options or another option if it's a third party situation in order for this, again, new relationship to start and judgment or for somebody to be open to accepting this new beginning, okay? Judgment here is I'm up first and I've got the moon. Okay, um, hmm. I feel like somebody would like to speak to tell the truth. However, you know, a sense of insecurities and uncertainties, unsure if this is going to be a good judgment call to be telling you the truth, or it could be you contemplating that, telling somebody the truth yourself. Again, it could go vice versa. Two of Pentacles is in reverse. We've got the Four of Wands and the Page of Cups in reverse. Somebody is waiting for a result. Somebody is waiting for a confirmation or a decision to either be in a relationship together if this is a fairly new connection or to reconcile if this is someone from your past, okay? For once, of course, it definitely indicates stability, but um, the only problem with this with this, some of these energies here is someone could be feeling kind of insecure, okay? Uh, unsure about if this person is telling the truth or unsure about the future of this connection. So there could still be some sneaking around or trying to figure out whether this connection is, um, is the one that they would like to be in or to, to reconcile, okay? Either or. Um, if you if you're currently connected to this person, yeah, or if you're separated from this person, if you're completely completely single, you have nothing from your past or nobody you're connected with currently, Pisces Ace of Cups just could indicate that maybe there's new love coming in, but first and foremost, you need to love yourself first. You know, the Empress, understand your value and your worth. But definitely see a big change coming in for you guys, Pisces. This big change, this transformation could be, for some of you, it's you being single for a while. And for some of you, it's you getting into a relationship, okay? It feels like there is a little bit of an indecisiveness here. But eventually, somebody, somebody is going to make a choice. And I feel like a new love will begin, a new relationship, okay? Or it could be a reconciliation for some of you getting back together with an ex an offer coming in but i don't know i feel like it's um, some of you maybe you accept it some of you i would say no because it's definitely a 50 50 chance here with the two of wands anyway pisces this is your reading hope you resonated if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm gonna leave you with two playlists on the screen right now first one is from my second channel it's a travel vlog channel and the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done with different timing. I mean, sorry, with different topic and different question. Um, so there could be some important messages for you over there. Just click on the second playlist that's on the screen right now and scroll all the way down. Look for your sign, okay, Pisces? And also I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. And Pisces, I post your videos almost every single day, but at different timing. <laughs> I skipped that part. Um, if you'd like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Alright, take care. Bye.